Hey everybody, it's Kit here. Happy Monday and welcome back to Love and Death Sims 4 uh, Life and Death series. I sold some of the plant stuff that he had and we were able to fix him up a tiny little house and now we're broke as all heck again. Um, I'm going to sell those. going to give him a few things in here. We'll let him keep that. Do I? Did I? I did. Chuck that. Uh, we'll keep those for fishing, and as much as $76 would be nice. Yeah. So, um, the new wallpaper, I love it, by the way. We're gonna put some of this stuff up, so that he's got a little bit of a reminder. Um... Don't ask me what I'm doing. I don't know. We still need to get a, um, we still need to get some, something, I'm thinking. Also, we got the high spellcaster, uh, card. Seen and unseen, thou art the path between. The high spellcaster dwells where light and dark share a delicate balance. Those who draw wisdom from this duality may unlock her ethereal presence. As a vessel of divine femininity, her essence and the cycle of the moon are closely entwined. She personif uh, personifies magic in all forms and is guided by the rhythmic pulse of her own intuition. Once five, the 25 tarot cards in Ravenwood have been found, summon Grim to aid you in your quest to complete the deck. And then you can complete, create the deck once 26 cards are found. So, I thought that was interesting. No, we're going to hold on to that, actually. Yeah, anyway. So, he's a little hungry. Um, but the raven would think, collect a soul. Collecting souls are a key aspect of the Reaper career and building toward that soul quota. Attend an active work day in the Reaper career and collect a soul. And then you want to eat food. We can do that. Yeah. Go on. Take a shower, dude. Why can't you reach it? Okay. Well, we'll go on ahead and put it in your house. I need to get a little bit more money and suit it up a little bit more. But this was just a quick little what I have. I figure he can get some food when he's out. Hi. Oh, we'll uh, invite him in after this. Hello from the other side. You don't know me, so this might sound weird, but you're going to inherit from me, kid. Why, you might ask. Let's just say it's better for both of us if you don't ask questions. The money needs to go somewhere in quick, and I heard through the grapevine that you were a good upstanding sim, so you're about to inherit a chunk of my heart and so on. <laughs> Listen, buddy, part of life is planning for your death. You should write up a well when you're ready to choose who's going to inherit your simulants, your heirlooms, and your kids. What? Wait, I'm sorry. Sorry, who's going to inherit my kids? What? <laughs> I'm assuming you mean guardians, but like that way that you said that is so weird. I did mine on the computer, but you can call an inheritance lawyer to help you write one too if you want. Just uh, make a choices in life, kid. I sure didn't. Yeah, give me money. Cool, thanks. You gonna be done? Anyway, let's see what this guy wants. Yabba's thanks. Nice outfit. We'll give a funny introduction. Let's see here. And he didn't have a uh, mood lit from sleeping in that. And Armin, you're coming with us. We're going to Crow's Crossing today. Uh oh. Oh. Sorry, I just realized that my screen is not fitting. Um, one minute, let me, where are we going? Guess we'll go to the cemetery. I'm gonna fix this. I don't know what's going on. Give me a minute. Okay, figured out what I was doing wrong. Oopsie, sorry. Um, okay, so now y'all can kind of see. Alright, we're in Crow's Crossing! Um, we're at 
at the cemetery. Mourner May Prescott. Update frame and flowers. Assign some to memorial plot. Ten gravesite. Drag some. This is so cool. Oh, I love how they're all a little different. This is really cute. Can you fish in here? Fishing allowed sign. Okay, but you can look for water. Oh, water. Well, yeah, but look for frogs. Oh, wow. I like this. I actually really do like this. Change gravesite plot to stone. Oh, and Nalani is a mourner as well. <laughs> Cemetery Keeper. Let's, uh... Huh. Explore the crypts. One might do that. Oh, wow. I really like this. Dedicate dis memorial display to household. Whoa! Okay! You can, you can sleep in the coffin at the cemetery if you want. I see something we're gonna go get. What is this? A jogger? Oh, wow. I like this. This is actually really well decorated, given EA has a certain reputation for not. Place flower, spray, tribute, place for your drape. This is really freaking cool. Wow. Yeah. I like it. I like it a lot, actually. Okay. Another little thing. Toss a coin, and there's a bonfire with a ghost. All right. All right. This is really cool. I like this. I can't wait to see what the other um, what other sim, sorry, simmers do with it. Okay, so I'm already seeing two places. Focus camera on recollector sign. Okay. Why? Wow, we already have several things here. Oh, oh, we got another shrine. All right. Oh, wow. Look at how cute this is. <laughs> oh, my God. <clears throat> that got me. Oh, another one? Mysterious Merchant? Okay. So, wow, there's like a lot of graves here. I love that so much. It's so morbid, but I love it. Oh, wow, that's actually a really cute little house. I like that. Oh, and I see... Is that the painting career? That is the painting career one, I think. Just getting an overview of the land. We got a telescope. Yeah, this would be a great place, I think, to do rags and riches. At least for the collecting aspect. Oh, my God. <laughs> okay, start well, ancient archives. Cool. Gold blue. <laughs> They're in that stupid costume, and I love it. All right. We're gonna, we'll go to the center in a second. I'm, uh, I'm trying to get the lay of the land all the way out here. Okay, so we got a fishing spot. See, another great spot. Oh, wow, that's really pretty, actually. <gasps> oh, oh, I love that. Look at that. Also, um, if my game looks a little different, I fixed my G-Shade. That's why. So it's just a little bit brighter. I might play around with the shaders, and it might change a little bit. You, you're, you've been warned a little bit. Apologies. Okay. Well, at least you're still normal. Oh, my God. Whoa. That house looks incredible. Oh. oh. I see that over there. Can't reach that. That looks really cool. This house looks pretty damn good. Dang. Okay. Alright. So, where where am I? I'm... I'm I'm over here. This is a fairly big place. Holy crap. Okay. Oh my gosh. Look at this. That looks so creepy. I freaking love it. I'm sorry if that's loud. 
I'm just so happy it works again. Oh no, I've heard a lot of, I've heard very little about you, but you look angry. Wish for, use intuition, ask about Alice's sorrow. Oh, I need to f ask, I need to find Alice in the morning veil before I can ask her about that. Attempt to communicate, mock, nope. Uh-oh. Oh, there it goes. Um, nope. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> nope. <laughs> nope. 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 <laughs> There's actually a lot of frogs around here, and I'm very happy about that. There's actually a lot of collectibles, so this will actually go really well with um, the gem creation thing. Whoa, hold up. Explore old golden oldies. <laughs> vacant house, ghostly infest, must be a ghost. Old vacant house must be infested by a ghost sim first. Oh, cool. You could do it on all of these? That's amazing. How many more can we do it on? Any more? Maybe not, but that's okay. The fact that we can do that is pretty dang cool. Have I missed anything? Let's see. Just decoration looking. It looks so freaking cool though. Like, I love the little goats. The question is, are they demonic or not? Oh my god. Oh, how many frogs? This is amazing. View Moppy the goat. Oh my god. That has to be the cutest damn statue I've ever seen in my life. Look at it! I need to get a baby goat, guys. I think... Do y'all think we should get him a baby goat just because... This... Okay. And then we've got this. Oh my god, I love this. I... Can't get over this. <laughs> I can't. No! <laughs> oh no, not again! No! Oh, no. Okay, I was thinking there might be some food around here, but I mean, if he's making some, that's fine. Oh, look at it! I love them. Okay, this is cool. All right. Okay, I want him... God, there's so many different things. Let's come over here and give this guy a friendly introduction. I think I want to have him explore the underground crypts, and we'll also go see the old house today. Wow, you look really cool. Close Hi! Oh. 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 oh, okay. So let's see, can we ask anything? Ravenwood rumors, all right. Oh good, I did turn off my mods. I was like, this seems like a lot of options, but no, that's just, that's just how it is. Cemetery keeping. I'm just trying to see if there's anything like super duper now. Also, Lori, you said embraced by death, and I thought that was a uh, I thought that was a um event, but now I'm kind of confused. Oh, you said embrace my death by the, the... Never mind, never mind. I get you now. You met the trait. You met the trait. Okay, I forgot about that. Never mind. Thank you. <laughs> I'm dumb. I'm so dumb. Sorry. <laughs> I'm so, so, so dumb. Um, okay. It's fine. Because I think he's got a retrait potion. Sweet pants up. Yeah, pretty shady. Fourth up? <laughs> Employ. Mm -hmm. Yep. I'm trying to think which one we'll redo. Uh, maybe not adventurous. I'm thinking hot-headed. I like the other ones. I normally want to have a bad one, but if I can add it, I will. Okay, whoa, hold up. Ravenwood rumors. Our family history has been convoluted over the years, to put it mildly. At least my grandfather had the good sense to start deciding which items should be considered heirlooms for the family so they could be divvied up properly. My father, not so much. And when my sister and I passed... <gasps> oh, 
when when my sister and I passed away, it was a mess. Now that I have my second chance at life and all of that, I'm leaving a better example for Zelmira. I want them to feel a connection to all the things that matter to me enough to consider a part of our family story. Cemetery keeping is great if you don't mind a ghost here and there. You can try it for yourself if you join the Undertaker career. All right, just getting that makes me want to come in and grab all the pre-mades and add them to my Through the Veil. Should I do that? Okay, well, um, yeah, cool, thank you. <coughs> Sorry, should have, uh, muted out for that one. Okay, um, well, bison stew, let's do, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> she was getting to like do reverence or something huh a oh wait no we don't want to talk to you um michael bell what are you doing <laughs> no i just recognized the name oh no no oh my god how much are you cooking my dude ah uh. ah uh. uh. Oh my god, okay, alright. Okay. Uh. <laughs> I'm dying. Okay, who are you talking to? Is it that one? I want to ask about this. Funeral? We're at a funeral? <laughs> wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> wait a minute, we're at a funeral? Wait a minute. Cause I thought this was the uh, festival could be found every Tuesday, Thursday, Sunday from 11 to 5. Crow's Crossing celebration of life is occurring near the center of Crow's Crossing. Okay. Monday, Tuesday, Friday, Whispering Glen. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, I'm... Yes, Compliment outfit. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry for laughing at you, my dear. Oh, that's nice. Okay. Yeah. Alright. Not gonna choke, I guess. Uh, it's all about just that celebrating the lives of the living and the dead. Enjoy a few music and good company while reminiscing about dearly departed loved ones. Aww. That's nice. Um. What's with the funeral, I wonder? I'm just trying to see if there's anything new. I think I think we're okay. <laughs> no. Is there a new station? I don't think there is, no. So I'm gonna let him dance for a second. <laughs> Well, this is, gr I mean, honestly, though, this would be an excellent place to do a rags to riches. As long as Edith, Edith does not kill you. Sit and chat here. I was thinking there'd be maybe a little bit more to do, but... Oh, thank God, there's a bathroom. See, I mean, this would be an awesome place. 
And then we'll chat with the specter. I told you to go to the bathroom first. Okay. Um, celebrity sighting. Came for the food from Crow's Cross and Celebration of Life. Dane appreciates the free food. Shame about the occasion. <laughs> Oh, man. <laughs> <clears throat> What's with this jogger thing? Is there a jogging thing nearby? Hang on. Let's follow the path in here. Wait, no. Um, I want you... Where's the house? Go explore. And while I try to find this jogging thing... I think I need to introduce myself to that ghost. Oh yeah, we do have to do this stuff. Thanatology. Understand the basics. Reading theories on a computer. Ordering thanatology skill books. Or even joining the Reaper or Undertaker careers. And we need to do some writing. So we need a computer. Well, oh, I was about to say that's going to take a while. But we just got 4,000. Oh, right, you. Hey! There's a crow. Cheerful introduction to this guy. I love this. This is so cool. I love this pack so far, you guys. What do y'all. <gasps> Look! Oh! I love it! Same old house from exploring a cleansed house. Well, that was a letdown. Dane wandered through the olden goldies, but the spookiness didn't quite live up to the hype. The cobbles and creaky floors were more tedious than terrifying, leaving him feeling underwhelmed. It seems these old houses have lost their edge. Maybe next time we'll find something a bit more exciting. That's really cool, though. Hi. Yeah, go get to know Sarah Scott. Hi, come over here. Cheerful introduction to him. I love that the crows are here. I forgot he had the glowing eyes for a second here, I'm going to be honest. Actually, I should put him in a different outfit. He was wearing that last time. Hang on. He's got multiple. I just don't know why he didn't change into it. Ah, Lee Baker are. <laughs> That's really cute. Oh, is that in build by mode, actually? I like that. Woohoo! <laughs> <coughs> Ask Ghost for help. <gasps> Repairing. Cleaning. Oh, that's cool. Purchase authentic pre-made will. Take a chance on a mysterious item. Purchase wares. Ask about mysterious items. Free Haggle. Oh, no. Orphan. Kabura. Habaray. Subao Habaray. Noom Fra. Oh, I think we're gonna do that 750 random. Oh, we got the money. Lenargat maybe. Shui Bao. Griffin new play. So can we make children as um yeah. ghosts? I need to check that. I offer a variety of mysterious items for the discerning sim. Some very rare treasures indeed. Never you mind where I got them today. <laughs> I offer a flat rate and you get what you get. What do you say? <laughs> well, how can I how can I not take up that offer? Do you have a hard bargain? Hell yeah, twenty five percent off. Okay, we can get a uh, death flower, but I just planted one. I don't need it. Essence of anger, grim deluxe ascendant crow, a soul. I'm gonna grab that just to have it, and we're gonna grab these. The chariot. With the strength of his mind and willpower, the chariot needs no reins. As with land, one must grab onto their goals by taking action. Through tugged, though tugged by opposing forces, the charioteer steers with sheer resolve. Be forewarned, failing to grasp control of one's own life can be can lead to being lost in a swirl of directionless rhythms. The Hermit. As an old soul, the Hermit stands at the peak of her growth and accomplishments. Guided by the light of life, she studies herself upon her broom of a symbol of her own authority over time's dusty existence. Though the full path ahead may not be revealed, she strides forth with conviction out of the the darkness and into the light, balancing introspection with caution towards loneliness should no one knock her way. Balancing introspection with caution. 
towards loneliness. Should no one knock her way. Uh, nope, my brain is not. Oh, oh, chariot. Did I just miss that last time? Thanks for some loans, or I mean patronage. The stuff might be in your inventory or household inventory. I don't really know or care. Wow. <laughs> Set ghost color? That's... Yo! That's so cool. I love that. Okay. Um, I'm... Self fear and goodwill essence. Okay. Uh, we're gonna do that. Let's see what we have here. One death flower delivered straight to your inventory. Was this a window or a blunder? That's for you to decide, but no refunds. Just be careful with it or don't. Oh, hey! Well, we got one for cheaper, so that works. Okay. I want to see if there's anything that's, like, more ghost-oriented. Oh, tarot. There we go. See? Or just this pack in general. We'll do that again. Because it's somebody different. Ask about being dead. Expanding the family. Oh yeah, that'll go great. Ask him his career. He might have a special one considering he's a specific in BC. Okay. And I think that's it. And then we're going to have him go be over here with this crow. He needs to take care of his crow at home. Tarot is an ancient form of divination. One can tap into intuition and through the readings can find clarity or guidance inner desires come forth and the university's influence takes hold amongst the tarot community there are whispers of a magical debt waiting to be found a secret order has been performing rituals throughout ravenwood and their sacred site a tarot tarot tome shrine could reveal some truth and rumors and he is unemployed cosmic quest from asking about tarot Dane's heart beats with excitement excuse me as Dane finishes begins his spiritual journey learning about the magical art of tarot Sage advice on family. Huh? Okay. The bird is gone! No! Oh, that's okay. We'll figure it out. What am I hearing? I don't know what I'm hearing. Use intuition. Ooh, I think we're going to do that in a second here. All right, come on. <laughs> Are you gonna? Ask? You need me standing up for that and just stop. Ooh. Where's the moon? Is there a moon? It's just so kind of bright here. I like to think of myself as the undesignated, unasked-for guardian of the crypt here. So trust me, I know what everyone gets up to when they're in there. That's right, that's right. When you... <laughs> when you woohoo in there, you're shaming yourself. Oh, come on, I'm kidding. What, you think I've never had an amorous thought in my life or after? <laughs> Use intuition, all right. Um, oh my god. Use it twice, three times, and then we're gonna have him go explore the underground crypt. Ugh. Oh my god. Oh, that was so funny. Suspension. Oh! Whoa, that looks cool. Relinquish thyself to the power of suspension. Behold, he now hangs betwixt the threads of time, having sacrificed his soul for greater enlightenment. Oh, yes. His certainty can be shared, so long as one surrenders fully. Delays only yield inevitable conclusions. Okay. Oh! The Wheel of Fortune. Look at that. That looks cool. 
Immersed amongst the building blocks of life and death, the Wheel of Fortune spins its cycle to determine one's destiny. The wheel holds both the learnings of the cow plant and the ever-approaching fate of the netherworld. Forever in rotation, as one comes up, the other must come down. That's cool. I like this. Dane enters the crypts. Oh, that was cool. A labyrinth of forgotten corridors and ancestral vaults lie ahead. Into uh, if you dare. I like the little lights. It follows. Dane stumbles into a dimly lit room with an open sarcophagus and scattered debris strewn about the floor. Cobwebs and dust line the sarcophagus's opening, suggesting that whoever was here must have been gone for quite some time. Light a candle and continue exploring. Rummage sarcophagus. Ooh. Light a candle. Respite for the departed. Taking time to remember those who have been lost to... This earthly realm fills Dane with calm. And yay, he's on an adventure. Oh, and you're sick, are you? Great. Whoa. Oh. Wayland's hideout? I love the music. Dane peers inside and is met with a mysterious trench coat wearing fellow. The stranger is holding a box, but it's too dark to see its contents. Welcome, welcome, welcome to Wayland's Pop-In Shop. I have some fine items available for free, as long as you ain't afraid of a bit of chance. Lady Luck may be on your side. He shakes the boss enti box enticingly. Yeah, rummage blindly. love this. This is so cool. An unexpected reward. Well, well, well. It appears Lady Luck was on your side after all. Dane sees, receives some epic loot from this mysterious stranger. You can find it in Dane's inventory. Ninety-six dollars! Epic loot, huh? That's the death power we just got. Can't do anything with the soul. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, not enough musical school. Interesting. Play a little tune. Dane comes across what looks to be some sort of musical puzzle. Perplexed, Dane deduces that he will need to play the correct sequence of notes, notes on a dust gilded piano that has taken up residence in the crypt. Investigating further, Dane spies some sheet music, which would likely make this puzzle a breeze for anyone skilled in music. Well, we have to improvise. I'm loving this. This is so cool! Oh my god, the sounds! Sounds like traveling. <laughs> uh, Dane hits a few notes, making a terrible sound, causing the cover of the piano to violently snap shut. A trap door appears underneath him, resulting in a short fall into a dusty room below. Once back on his feet, a light to the outside world can be seen. Maybe it's time for Dane to cut his losses and head home. Exit the crypt. Okay, we're going to have to do that a lot more. That was so much fun. Cool. Alright, what else can we go finagle here? I want him to do some collecting. Hmm. I know we could do some fishing. I might have him do that in a bit. I want him to do some collecting. I want to go see that tarot. Hang on. There's a ghost in this. I love this. Striped dirt frog. Bone Hilda impersonator? Hold up. Ah, Hang on. What is with this? Anything? Excuse me. Um. Hmm. 
Hmm. Whoops, one out, one too many. Uh, maybe nothing? I wonder. What's. But why? Why Bone Hilda? I think it's funny, but why? I'm not gonna get an answer. No! <laughs> I want. I want an answer. <sighs> no! Alright. Fine. Go explore the house. A medical intern at Cut and Gut Health. The what? <laughs> I'm sorry, what? Alright, we're gonna save Edith. Edith for the last. That's what we're gonna do. Over here and review that as well. God, this looks so cool. The design of this place is absolutely amazing. I love the fog. I love it. It's so spooky. Um, oh, wow. You can use your intuition there. I think we're going on in a minute. Um, look at the little ghosties. I like that they're here. I love this so much. Wow. Um, uh, I wonder, but, like, people are jogging, so how did they manage, like, what's the purpose, I guess? Like, is there a sign or something? Okay, I don't know which ones he's got. Death Frog. Okay. The Order of Lenore. Right, we already read this. Garvin Rayburn Festivals find the helpers of the Order of Lenore. It's Elmira Gomez. Gomes? Gomes? Uh, learn more about the tasks. I need to go find- I didn't find any of these, right? Yeah. Oldies chill. Whoop. Hold up, it's about to disappear on me. Yikes! Dane is feeling seriously spooked after exploring the golden oldies. The eerie creaks and sudden chills have left him trembling with fear. It's as if the mansions themselves were alive and every shadow seemed to hide his prize. This experience might just keep him awake at night. <laughs> Uh, he's having a great time here, isn't he? <laughs> Alright, limestone. Okay, so it was that one. So which ones have we not gotten? Did we get everything? It's not a big deal if we didn't, but you know, money. Oh lord, that looks a little spooky, doesn't it? Oh gosh. Alright! Um, if I can gather these things before she comes to say hi. Oh, wow. This looks so creepy. And then we're going to use our intuition. Wish for a long life, untold riches, skill gains, removal of otherworldly curse. What? A luck and love, easier to manage needs, courage to face it. <laughs> I'm loving this so much. I love this. Oh god, where'd she go? Did she disappear? Whoa, there's more? Or is this where we... Aww. Is this hers? What is that? Oh, that's the tarot thing. Has to be hers, right? I feel kind of bad. Go get it. Oh god, she's coming back. You you had a golden opportunity, my dude. Dane never knows what's lurking in the dark. Darkness is nothing but a veil to hide the most gruesome and terrifying creatures of the night. It feels like they could pop out at any moment. And lately, this man named Vladixus keeps calling. <laughs> I can't say the name. 
Oh, no! Horrifying presence from Edith. Oh, boy. Dane can feel the hair on the back of his neck, ri neck rise. She is here. Edith is here. <gasps> Looming dread. Oh, my goodness. Dane, you're all right. Go look for frogs. You can do it. What you seek cannot be found. It takes time to develop a strong intuition. Take a deep breath and try again. Go get it. Come on. You can do it. Period of the dark. Looming dread from fear of the dark. Oh, well. Mm. All right. Gonna, we're going to give this a go. Oh, we're going to give this a go. It's okay. You're okay. You're okay, buddy. You're okay. Hi. Don't bite me like Greg. <laughs> <laughs> Look at his face! <laughs> God, she's so short. She just she's in here with the fog. <laughs> oh my God! That scared me. Oh, that got me. Oh, oh. Oh, I was not expecting to see that. Sorry if I'm a little loud. How bad is this going to go? Uh, oh. Really? Oh! Uh. Death appears to be open to further conversation, so maybe a good time to... So, it may be a good time to build a friendship with our tread lightly, though. To many negative interactions, and they may have started attempts of communication over again. Mark of Edith. Well of longing and regret. We're going to ask about it. Hi. Try to chat. I'm just going to fix his needs right now. I'm going to have him fish. Uh-oh. Aw. One simoleon for a wish, a dream, or a nightmare, but gain my trust. Ask for my mark, and the best dream you will have. Am I just... Well, actually, I'm, I'm afraid to say what I'm thinking. Did I just get lucky? I'll take it. Choba Quimsba. Beba's in boy. With Tuni de Foon. What is that mark? Gristle Fwib? Bean. Yeah, Bingo Zeppel. God, he doesn't know how to ask this. This feels weird asking a child for this, though. Uh. <laughs> what the hell? <sighs> the way she just did that scared the shit out of me. Two hours. Mark of Edith. Dane has made a positive impression on Edith. You better make a wish at the well of longing and regret while this good luck lasts. Nope. Um. Okay, we're going to use our t intuition again. And what should we wish for? I want to see this easier to manage needs thing. Okay, we didn't get anything there. This is so cool looking. Look at that, though. Even though it shows the lines in his face very weirdly. Oh, look at this. I'm sorry for all the pictures, you guys. I'm, I'm loving this, though. A greatly fulfilled wish. With the mark of Edith on his side, Dane tosses a coin into the well. He can fill his knees, recharging. How refreshing. Okay, so it's just a recharge thing. And it's one per... His well runneth over. So it's one per... Okay, that's fine. I kind of... I probably should have... I, I probably did just waste that, given I just cheated them up. But, hey, I know what they are now. Use intuition, read. 
Is there anything else that I wanted to go sneak around and look at? Um, nope. Do not turn paranoid. You're not allowed. Edith Basu died from drowning. Aww. Loved yet misunderstood with a hint of playful mischief when the moon is only partially a shine. A true moon child. Aw. Poor kid. She's scary as hell, but poor kid. Alright, anything else? I think what I will have him do Let's come read the collector sign. What's what is this? We have bills. Dear future business friend, a representative of the Guild of Awesome Collections will be here at Crow's Crossing by the sign to buy your cool stuff every Monday, Thursday, and Saturday during the Ravenwood Family Day. Be sure to check back at these days or keep an eye out for our signs in other neighborhoods. Oh, okay, cool. <laughs> oh boy, well you're laughing your butt off, which is going to be fun for work. Alright, I think, I was thinking of having him go look at the crypt, but I think, given what time it is, let's just put him over here to do some fishing and see what he catches. Speed three, you know what I mean? When does work start? Nine. So we'll let him do it for just a little bit, feel confident outside at night. Yeah, good luck with that. I love this so much. <laughs> Angelfish! A tuna. Level 9. Scourge of the pond. Where dang goes? Fish tremble with fear. Can now partially angle, patiently angle for a big catch. And now tropical sharks and pick me swordfish. Let me actually change to the angler one since he's close. Wait, he just got level 9. Okay, I'm just gonna... Yeah, there we go. Okay, work for Dane starts in an hour. Look at that! Really? He d Twenty-one hours? Wait a minute, does that just... I think that lasts for 24 hours. Holy crap! Alright, well... I'm going to be done for today. Um, we're going to go into our work. And then... Depending. Hang on. I saw this in my other save file. I think it says when these events are. Maybe. <laughs> oh, wait. No, it's Monday. Oh, okay. Right. Festival of Youth. Starlight Accolades. Then to festival, moon revelry. We might go to the moon revelry one. Um, a funeral event. Oh, okay, cool. Uh, spice. Oh, spice is on Friday. I didn't know that. Ravenwood Family Day, Finchwood Cow Fair, Festival Youth Flea Market. Is the, um, I thought the one, the, the one we just did today, I thought that was always on Sundays, is it not? GeekCon, Thin Festival, we'll see, it's all there, so I don't know why it's not every time. I'm confused. Alright. I mean, that's fine. I have no idea how this works. Why are there multiple spooky days? I'm confused. Okay. Anyway. So, we're gonna go with him for his work 
days. I'm going to play that at least a little while. Um, y'all let me know. How, how do y'all want me to do this with the active career? Because I know going and looking and everything else. Like, if I'm personally watching it, I like following along and seeing every single day, even if it's kind of dull or boring or whatever. But how do y'all want me to do this? Like, I'm sure for a while... Y'all want me to go every single time and, like, record that. But when it comes to just, like, exploring the pack and stuff, do y'all want me to just take it slow like that? Or, okay, let's do a, a day here and there. Um, like, I figure at least for the first few or several days we'll go um, as we get new things and whatnot. But, um... Yeah, just, just let me know how y'all want me to do that. Um, but yeah, so this is really cool. I really like this area. I'm actually just really impressed with how cool this dang pack is. Like, it's so detailed in a lot of ways. Now, this thing was kind of, yeah, maybe, you know, I mean, maybe I uh, was it doing it right. Maybe it was just kind of slow this one day. Um... But I love how much detail there is and how big the places seem to be. And I love Edith and everything else. And I think I got lucky there, but hey, I'll take it because I can see where she can kick your ass. I can tell. Oh my gosh. But I mean, look at this. It looks so cool too. So yeah, I'm having a blast. Next time we're going to go for his job and then we might go to the revelry or the the glen or we might work on the new thing i don't know we'll figure it out i still need to do oh is this a co-worker i love that look at that a little crow i want one <laughs> That looks so cool. I love this so much. <laughs> That's going to be us next time. Um, but yeah, thank y'all so very much for watching. I really appreciate y'all. Um, if you have a new pack, let me know what y'all think about it. Um, and just give me some ideas and whatnot. Oh, actually. Let's just do the... the um, Death Frog, zero, rare, what? Hang on, before we, we do this, uh, let me retreat. Quickly, before you go to work, dude. Okay, so we have to pick... So, do I want him to stay angry and be more outgoing? Genius. Right. Um... I'm assuming this is what you meant, Lori. Because you said embraced by death, right? Alright, I usually have a rule where I like to keep hot-headed. Like, I like to keep a, a negative trait just to make it e to make it more interesting. But I am going to get rid of it. We're going to go with... Oh, it was that. Let me, let me double check. <laughs> I don't want to goof it up. Uh, embraced by death, cross crossing. So yeah, I think I think you meant chased. I, I think, unless there's an embrace, that would be cool. But I'm pretty sure you meant this one. Okay, chased. Yeah. Yeah. So chased by death. Sims know that death follows their every move. While risky and dangerous behaviors may have deadly consequences, and frequent near-death experiences give these Sims a desire to live each day to the fullest in progress along their soul's journey faster. Keenly aware of their own mortality, these Sims feel best when they're achieving something meaningful with their limited time left. Is this the new Unlucky? If that is, that's amazing, and I freaking love it. Oh, oh. Death calls. It's time for Dane to head to work. Care to join him or should Jane re Dane reap alone? I'll see y'all next time. Have a good one. Bye.